Hi, good evening. Hi, Hello. good evening, teacher. Hi, Orlando, how are you? Fine. Good evening. Good evening, Ellie. Good Hi, Ellie, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. All right, nice to have you. Hi, Carlos, Emilio. Elmer, hello, Daniel. Who else do I have that? I have more people here, I think. Oh, no. Carlos, Emilio, me escucha? Hoy si le escucho. Excellent, very good. All right. Hi, Rocio. Your microphone, Rocio. Rocio, your mic is off. Oh, hi, Rocio. Hi, hi. Hi, how are you? Hi, Jessica. Fine, fine. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. <laughs> Excellent. All right, guys. So yesterday for Carlos that was not in class and Ellie that was not in class either. Daniel del Cid, were you in class yesterday? No, right? Yeah, yeah. You were. Promise. <laughs> no, now I remember you were. All right. Okay. So for Carlos and Ellie that were not in class, yesterday we were talking about the present perfect continuous. That was the topic that we studied yesterday. Okay. So we're going to continue talking a little okay. bit about that just to make sure that you guys understand it really well. Uh, we were talking about two special words that we use in tense that are for and since. You remember that? Yes. Yes. For, All right. for and since. Yes. yes. When the, let's see, Daniel. I, when do we use for? For when we use um, periods. Uh huh. Uh, I have been living in London for years. Okay, very good. Okay, four years or for four years or how many years? But I don't know ex specifically when you began to live there, right? I don't know which year you began to live in that place. All right. What about since Elmer? <coughs> when do we use since? What, what is the question, teacher? The Excuse question me. is, when do we use since, Elmer? Since, when is a, a thing specific, like a month, like a date, like a, um, maybe a day or weekend, okay. hour, um, whatever that. Right, very good, Elmer. When you have a specific time, all right, like uh, at five o'clock or since five o'clock, since Monday, since Wednesday, since December. So when you have a specific, a specific time, then you use since. Hi, Gadiel. Hi, Walter. All right. So that's the difference between since and for. Now, um, Gadiel, were you in class yesterday? Yes. Yes. Gadiel was in class. Walter, I know you were in class, but Gadiel? I can't remember. All right, so let me see. Um, Rocio, when do we use, when do we use the present perfect continuous, Rocio? Uh, Rocio, can you hear me? Yes, yes. When do we use the present perfect continuous? Uh, when you uh, talk about uh, an action that begin that began in the past. Okay. You are, but you are doing in in the. In the present too. Uh huh. And at the yeah. moment, right? At the moment, yes. Also, yes. okay. Mm -hmm. So it touches, like, let's say it touches three times or three mm -hmm. moments. It touches the past because you already began the action. It touches the present, but it also touches. So, for example, you say, I have been studying English for 
five months okay so you began five months ago you are studying it like in the present and you continue in the present in the now okay because you say i have been studying english for five months but you haven't stopped okay okay, okay. so that is the biggest difference of the present perfect continuous i just have this um exercise that i want you to work on okay so i'm gonna show it to you right now and this is just practicing present perfect progressive or present perfect continuous which is the same and also the for and since can you guys please take a picture i think there are more sentences here take the first picture there are not there are six um sentences finished a moment a moment okay yes okay thank you and then we have two more hold on hold on hold on yeah we're gonna do this exercise first okay can we do like copy seven and eight too please okay. Hay como una bulla por ahí, no sé de quién es, que soy gente como hablando, I don't know. If it's you, then yeah, very good, thank you. All right, let's see. So here, this is what we have to do. It's, this is the example. Look at the example, it says the baby is crying. She started to cry 20 minutes ago. If you notice, they're using the baby is crying okay and she started to cry 20 minutes ago now with those two sentences you have to make one and the example says the baby has been crying for 20 minutes okay it depends on the information that you're going to use for and you're going to use since do you understand what you have to do yes 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 no okay no no for me Okay, Elmer, so you have two sentences. Yeah. The baby's crying. She started to cry 20 minutes ago. With, bo with both, both pieces of information, put them or make one sentence using mm -hmm. present perfect progressive or present perfect continuous plus mm -hmm. for or since. Okay. It, depending on the context of the sentence, you're going to mm -hmm. use for or you're going to use since okay okay so we have eight sentences okay did you copy them or did you take a picture of everything yeah okay very good okay so here let's just start with this we're going to have another exercise i just want to make sure that you understand this topic and then next week we're going to start topic our section number three okay say but just to make sure that we understand everything there you go Ah, Noemi is in class. Hi, Noe.
Hi, Daniel. Hi, Daniel. Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you? Evening. Fine, how are you? Fine. I'm sorry Excellent. to be late. <laughs> don't, don't worry about it, Daniel. Don't worry. I'm going to send you to the breakout room, okay? And they're working on an exercise about the present perfect continuous using for or using this, okay? Okay. All right. So I'm going to send you right now and they can share the pictures with you. Okay. It has been. It has been snowing. snowing. Yes, yes. Snowing. Uh huh. Since. Since last night. Correct. Right. Right. Uh, last night. Elisita, yes. que me le había pasado, Eli. Estaba enferma, teacher. Viera que. Dale. Sí, es que como con esto de los cambios de clima me pongo bien mala de la garganta. Ah, ok. Y he estado intentando ver los videos ahí en el, en el YouTube, pero algo perdidita me siento. Ok. Porque están un poco difíciles los temas. Pero sí los he estado viendo ahí en el YouTube. Lo único que sí no ha avanzado en la plataforma. Ah, ok. okay. Porque intenté hacer el 1.9 pero no, no supe qué, qué tenía que hacer y he estado viendo los videos para ver si en alguno me daba una pista, pero no, no sé realmente ah, okay. qué es lo que es. All right. Ok, Eli, pero ya se siente mejor. Pero sí, sí, ya. Lo único que siempre un poquito. Sí, así la escucho. Un poquito ronca, pero ya, ya mejor, bastante. <risa> ok. Bueno. Okay, okay, Por continue, eso. guys, okay? Okay. All right, thank you. Thank you. Black, the, children. the children are... Andrea has been working in a bank. In a bank since she last April. April. Since last April. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Since... Last April. Andrea has been working in a band since dance last April. Okay. Uh, it is correct, the first one. The tap has been leaking since last week. Yeah, it's okay. Okay. I'm confused uh, if I. I should use uh, this or for? No, that one's okay. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. You don't say for the for last week. Last week. Okay. Okay. Hey, the two Daniels are here. Daniel Delcida and Daniel Mendez. Yes. 
<laughs> All right. Okay. Number six. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mr. Nabil teach French. He started to teach French 15 years ago. Fin de semana me voy a poner al día. Mentira. <laughs> well, teachers say that you are on section five. Yeah, he's in yeah. section, I don't know, 10. <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys finish the sentences? A... Yes, yes teacher. teacher. Thank you for sharing the ah, presentation. Ah, Elmer, es que usted me tiene que acordar, Elmer. Ya, ya vi que murió todo. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, I don't want to hear a confession. <laughs> <You know? laughs> oh, no, don't worry about it, Gadiel. He's always bullying me. Yeah, yeah, I know, teacher. Yeah, he's just you. funny. But don't he loves me. I know it. he loves me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Did you guys write it anywhere, Elmer, and Gadiel, the sentences? Or you were just um, saying them, like, out loud? Or speaking about them? Speaking, teacher. Oh, you didn't copy them anywhere? The, the, the sentences the, right now. The sentences. Uh huh. For uh, the, uh, has a copy. Okay. And and my screen, a screen. Uh huh. Aquí están, teacher. Me extraña, magaña. How do you say me extraña, magaña? Pero no las ha hecho el mer. Ay, cómo las hago así, bien bonitas. No, escribo. pero es que usted el, el año pasado. Ajá. Así, así, en, en, Ajá. así a las oraciones así bien chiviricas. El, el man becomes like a lazy student. Yeah, lady. he's totally. He has, you know what, Gadiel? He changed a lot. Wow, Elmer, what happened with you? I don't know. What about he, the new year? The new year? Yeah, what his what new year's um, purpose. Purpose, oh, really? yeah, yeah, it's yeah. not not to not to love me anymore. <laughs> yes, the love is over. Oh, goodness, okay, bye, Elmer. Right. <laughs> gracias, gracias Sorry, por bye, la. Bye. You are very welcome, Elmer. Bye. So now, right. así lo voy a querer ahora. Ya me está bueno, está bueno, Entonces quiere decir que. Hi Carlos. Hi Eduardo. Hi, Hi teacher. Hi, teacher. Eduardo, no vi a qué hora entró. Antes de. de grupos. Le... No, ya antes de Leo. ¿Cómo se llama? Una. Leo. I don't remember the, the, the name, but it's recently, yeah, about 10 minutes. Oh, ok. Carlos, Emilio, ¿qué me le había pasado? Pero miren que aquí estamos queriendo, casi pegando la guinda, pero ya, vamos a... <risa> Ni modo, dije, ya me metí a esto, tengo que terminarlo, y no me claro, va a claro. no, no quiero para los cuarenta pesos, dije. <risa> oh, my goodness, Carlos. All right, pero van entendiendo, Carlos, lo que están haciendo ahorita. Honestamente, no. <risa> Bye. Ayer estábamos viendo el, el presente perfecto continuo, ¿verdad? Cuando, es cuando usted dice, por ejemplo, yo he estado aprendiendo inglés desde el año pasado. Ok, okay. entonces para formarlo en inglés tenemos que tener obviamente el subject, I, el auxiliar have, ¿verdad? Porque res, corresponde Tengo. al I, Ajá, I have, pero como auxiliar, no como verbo. I have been, porque así se forma el, pres el, el presente perfecto continuo. I have been, y luego el verbo que le sigue con ING. I have been studying, I have been sleeping, I have been working, ¿verdad? Y luego el resto de su oración. Ahora, dentro del tiempo verbal usamos las dos palabras como muy claves. For o since. El for es más general y el since es más específico. Entonces yo le digo, I have been studying English for five, excuse me, for five months, ¿ok? No sé realmente 
¿Cuándo exacto empezar? Empiezo a contar yo esos cinco meses. Puede ser que ahorita estoy en septiembre, puede ser que ahorita esté en enero, puede ser que ahorita estoy en diciembre, no lo sé. Solo le digo que yo he estado estudiando inglés por cinco meses. Okay. No, okay. Ahora yo le digo, yo he estado estudiando inglés desde enero, entonces ya le digo since, porque tengo un momento puntual. Desde que okay. el momento en que empecé yo a estudiar el inglés en este caso. Entonces, eso es un poco lo que estamos haciendo ahorita, como unir okay. la, las dos oraciones que están ahí y hacerla, convertirla en una sola, usando el tiempo presente perfecto, continuo que es que empezó una acción en el pasado, que está en el presente y que está pasando también ahorita, porque no solo se queda en el, en el presente, sino que está en este momento está pasando. En este momento yo sigo estudiando inglés. Por eso se llama presente perfecto continuo. No solo se queda en presente perfecto, ¿verdad? Sino que agregamos el continuo porque incluye el now. All right? Uh -huh. Entonces, eso como en resumido es lo que se ha estado haciendo. Ayer okay. empezamos con eso y tuvimos unos ejercicios. Pero okay. igual quería ver estos ejercicios de ahorita y otros. Eh, vamos a terminar estos, los vamos a revisar ya y luego tenemos okay. otro ejercicio, ¿ok? Ok, gracias, teacher. All right, very good. Thank you, Eduardo. Ok, thank you, welcome. Very good, ok. Hello. All right, let's see, guys. Let's see. Did you finish? Yes. yes. Excellent. Okay, yeah. let's see. Um, Eduardo, can you do number one for us, please? Well, yeah, number one, yeah. Eduardo, Eduardo? No? Yes. Um, the the first is that the tap has been leaking for one week. Ah, uh, but it says last week. La, uh, but the last for for one week is the last week is past. Okay. Uh -huh. so for since last since uh -huh. last week. Okay. That's right. Yes, the tap has been leaking. Since okay. last week, okay? Yeah. Do you understand what, everybody, do you guys understand what TAP is? Since. Yes. Yeah. Yes. That's last week. <laughs> no lleva el since. Excuse es, me? No lleva el since. Como no? Since. Yes. No lo, no lo mencionó. The TAP has been leaking. Leaking since last week. Last week. Ah, perdón. Hi, Noemisita. Chercita chula, preciosa. How are you? Ah, no, right. él todavía me quiere, mire, él me... <laughs> All right, Orlando, number two. <laughs> Orlando, can you read? Okay. Can, can you tell us number two, please? Yeah. Uh, it has been snowing since last night. Okay, very good. All right. Uh, Walter Guerrero, three. Okay. Uh, the children have been studying mm. for an hour ago. Ah, but you have the ago. So it's a specific. So since an hour ago. That's, no that's ago. El ago it's... lo hace específico, ¿sabe? El okay. ago, si, si solo dijera an hour, si solo dijéramos for an hour. Pero tenemos el ago, so since an hour ago. Since okay. an hour ago. Mm -hmm. Since an hour ago. Okay. Okay, very good. Next one, let's see, Ro, um, Rocio. Teacher, yes. But in the example, is the baby is crying, she started to cry 20 minutes ago. Pero le quitaron el ago. Okay, okay, okay. But uh -huh. yeah, I, I, have a, I, I have a little confused. <laughs> yes, uh -huh. yeah. Te Ahí? Teacher. My dear teacher. Oh, is this is your dear teacher. Yes, my dear student. <laughs> the, the, uh, if I, I, uh, I, I read that the, the sentence with, uh, without ego, I, I can, 
Useful. I can with with is is for. Yes, yes. Okay. Look at the example, Elmer. The baby ahí en la yeah, yeah. first sentence tenía el ago. Yes. Lo quitaron y solo lo dejaron, lo dejaron yes. for 20 minutes. Well, dejaron, well, with with Gadiel, I I uh, is with a with a ago. In, okay. In ah, this case, okay. it's for. Uh -huh. Okay, yes. In this case, yeah, for. Yeah, for an hour, entonces. Yeah. Le quedó. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right, that's okay. Very good. Thank you, my dear student. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Rocio. I love you. Ah, yeah, whatever. Aha, uh -huh. Rocio. Uh, no, for. For, for yes. yes. Willie smokes. He started to smoke when he was a teenager. Uh, Willie has been smoking. Uh, since yes. he was a teenager. Very good. Okay, since he was a teenager. Very nice. My dear teacher. Yes, my dear student. I I, I think the uh, teenager is a, a, a long time for a, a person. <laughs> for example, yes, uh, but, uh -huh. maybe the a uh, uh, 20, no, 15, because los teenagers, yes, 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 and 20 is the, 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 the first without teen, for example, yes, yes. yes it's a uh, um, uh, 14, 15, 16, it's a, a long time for, for, for that case. All right, yes, Elme, I understand it's your not point. specific, yeah, yeah, I understand your point, however. Uh, you don't say for a teenager since he was, let's see, Willie has been smoking for, a, for, for he was a teenager, no. No, you have to say since he was a teenager. This is very difficult, but it's a long yeah. time for me. I know, but it, it's, it is a long time, but it's like a specific, de los 13 a los 19. All right, porque no hay más allá de. Okay. All Bye. right. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Elmer. Let's see. Next one. Ellie, can you do a number five? Number five is Andrea has been working in a bar since last mm -hmm. April. Very good. Hey, Noemi, can you do number six? Noé. Se me fue Noemi. Ah, no, ahí está. Noemi, no. No, Noemi is not here. Uh, Daniel Méndez. One, two, uh, Number six. Num number six. <clears throat> Mr. Neville has been teaches. Has, has been, been teaching? Teaches has been, been teaching. Has has been teaching French since no for for fifteen years. For fifteen years, you will meet Diego. Okay, that's okay. Very good. Walter Guerrero, can you do number seven? Okay. Uh, so and you and you have been planning the vacation. Uh, since last winter last winter uh -huh. very good okay again in this case winter can be long can be many months like three months four months five months but it's in a specific time within the general time is in a specific time porque sabemos que solo hay un par de meses de invierno entonces se vuelve since all right, number eight, uh, Daniel Del Cid. Okay, um, the mechanic has been fixing my car since this morning. Yes, okay, very good. Okay, next one, guys. Here. All right, I want you to take a picture of, of this right now. You have to use the verbs that are up here 
The verbs that are up here, you have to use them in the present progressive, I mean, the present perfect progressive form, depending on what, on the context, okay? Did you take a picture already? No, I did. Okay, teach. Dale, teach. Okay, y ahí están las otras cuatro. Son 16. Okay. okay. Okay, so you have to choose the verb from the list below to complete the following sentences. Put the verb in the present perfect progressive tense, okay? So these verbs that you have up here, you have to read the sentences with your partner and then uh, use it in the, present pres in the present perfect progressive. Ready? Yes. Today. <laughs> there you go. No way.
been has been studying. Been studying in the classroom, but teacher hasn't come yet. Yeah. Mm, the number eight. Or, or talking. <laughs> mm -hmm. It could be. Okay. Uh, I put talking here. Hola. Hola, hola. Hola. Solo aquí se me perdió esto. Ay. Estoy por salir. Este, ¿cuál otro sigue? El 8. Ah, no, el 7. El 7. The students have
maestra no viene, algo así. No, porque no hay otro. Deliver. Deliver es entregar. O, o wait también. Esperaron en la clase por 20 minutos, pero la teacher no, no, no llega. Wait, waiting. Digo yo. What number are you working on? The teacher me asustó. <laughs> Why? Ah, ¿Y de dónde salió? Ay, es que Dios. como yo estoy compartiendo mi video. <risa> Mire, en, en el 7. <risa> ya me hizo reír, niña. Niña, que usted parece así de pronto. <risa> usted dijo, pero es imagen que está congelada, como está hablando esta mujer. <risa> Ay, está más tranquila de mí. <risa> oh, my goodness. Mire, ajá, what number? ¿Qué pasó? The, 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 the number seven, the student have been is waiting. Ajá. O studying. Cualquiera de las dos. O sea, las dos tienen sentido. Ajá. Podríamos usar las dos. Sí. Because at the end, it's by the, teach, the teacher hasn't come yet. Or you, what number is that? The students have been sitting in the classroom. You can also say that the students have been sitting in the classroom for 20 minutes, but the teacher hasn't, hasn't come yet. Y podemos repetir los verbos porque pusimos arriba el de sitting. Sitting. ¿En qué número? In the number one. Number one. This. Uh -huh. Maria, Maria is sitting in the coffee shop. For her by birth. Ah, no. Pero ahí sería Mari has been waiting. ¿Cuál? Has been waiting. Ah, waiting. Ajá. Ok. En la cafetería, es porque él lo está. Vaya, no es. ¿El qué? Has waiting, been waiting, pusimos. dice, dice. Ah, es cierto. Es que está <risas> Qué barbaridad, yo, hombre. Qué barbaridad, no es. Y ese chucho. <laughs> oh, it's crying. <laughs> Pobrecito. <laughs> All right. Elita se quedó sola. ¿Ve qué le pasó a Eli? Sí. Pásala para acá. ¿Qué le... ¿Qué no... ¿Por qué número no van, Walter? Y no es. Por la número. Ocho. Voy a mandar a Eli para acá. Va. Va, la voy. And the have accident that when, when is uh, between the car, the other cars. Okay, for example, the last year, one motorcycle die every day. Um, uh, uh, one uh, one motorcycle die per day. Yeah, maybe a uh, ten, maybe near to ten. Uh, no, because uh, uh, uh... yes, yes. Uh, what is uh, what number of motorcycle uh, die uh, daily? Yeah, daily. according. According the the national police, according the statistics, the statistics, the statistics, well, oh, national police, one motorcycle uh, die every day. Are you serious, Gadiel? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. For example, uh, and now, for example, the to why first January to. To five February, mm -hmm. according to the statistics. Statistics, yes. The statistics. One motorcycle die every day. Wow. Yeah. Incredible, eh? Yes, uh, when you drive a motorcycle, it's very dangerous. Yes, super dangerous, yes. Yeah. Yes. I am but a Elmer is, But Elmer is a, is a good motor. Is a good driver. A good driver. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> According to him. 
Ah, uh, claro, of course. Oh, no. According to him, <laughs> there are many things. All right. El mercito, you ride a motorcycle. Yes, teacher. I have car it and motorcycle, but I I hate uh, go to my job in car, for example. And my son uh, prefer to go with motorcycle. Oh, really? But yes. But you're have, careful uh, about. Yes, I I have I I never uh, have an accident have uh, three years in my motorcycle. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's I say very to, good. To, I have to. Uh, I I say to Gabriel, I I go with my son, but the the car uh, respect my line in the street. For example. Okay. Yeah. All right. Mm -hmm. Really, teacher. You have to be very careful, El Mercito. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys finish the sentences? Yes, yeah. teacher. My goodness, El Mer, you're such a flash. You finished Gab everything Gab Gab so Gabriel fast. Gabriel is, is a, a, a fast student. How do you have you you have in the in this class? Really? Oh my goodness! With you and Gabriel. My goodness, we're gonna we're gonna go back right now and check the answers, okay? Okay, okay. No. Ah, okay. Hey guys. Hi, Hi. Hi. Okay, so let's check. Um hold on, let's check the answers right now for this exercise that we were working on. So let me let me just let me get it here. Okay. So number one, Carlos Emilio, what do you think it is? Maria? One moment, please. One moment, please. <laughs> mm -hmm, that's okay. Maria, Maria, mm -hmm. Maria. Oh, ya la perdí, ya la tení. Yeah. Okay, that's okay. Maria, white, Maria has, yeah. has been waiting. Waiting, the, uh -huh. waiting, waiting, perdón, waiting at the coffee shop for her boyfriend for the past al four, al hour, but he still hums, hums ever. Hasn't, hasn't, uh huh. Hasn't arrived. Arrived. Very good. Thank you. Orlando, All right. All right. Two. Yes. Okay. The student has been studying Spanish Orlando since has, the semester sorry. began. Orlando has been or have been? Uh, have been. Sorry. Have been, right? Students because... have been. Very good. Number three, Eduardo. Um, I I have been working on this report for the past two years. Excellent. Oh, reports. Yes, thank report. you. Yeah, very good. Gadiel, number four. Okay, okay. You should you should pay your umbrella when you go out. It has been raining all day. Perfect, very good. Thank you, Gadiel. Next one, Na Eli, number five. Number five. The children have, have been watching television all evening. Okay. Next one, let's see. Uh, Elmer, can you do number six? Ya sabía que me iba a sacar esa. Why? John's back hurts. He has been lifting heavy boxes all morning. Heavy bo boxes, right? Yeah, heavy Thank boxes. You. Very good. Uh, number seven, Walter. Walter. <coughs> The student has been studying. Hello, hello. 
Uh -huh. Okay, the students have been sitting in the yes. class classroom for 20 minutes, but the teacher hasn't come yet. Very good. All right, Daniel Mendez, number eight. Fran has been driving the same car for almost 20 years. Hey. Hey. Number eight. eight. Oh, okay, right. The girl. <laughs> Sorry. That's okay. The girls have, have been talking on the okay. telephone for an hour. An hour, right? And he, he, you did number nine already. So has been driving for number nine, right? Number 10, who? Uh, let's see. Noemi, number 10? Number 10 is, uh, thank you. Mr. and Mrs. Burns are very exciting about going to China next summer. Uh -huh. They have been planning very good. this trip for over a year. Excellent. Aunque Very ahorita good. no creo que el bendito Burns quiera ir <laughs> a la China. All right. <laughs> Gabriel, can you do number 11? Okay, right now. 11. 11, 11. The mailman. The mailman. The mailman has been delivering the mail in our neighborhood for nearly 25 years. Okay. We're going to die on soon. Very good. All right. Orlando 12. Huh? Orlando 12. Okay. Uh, Rita and Carly are at the mall. Uh, they have been shopping since the store opened <laughs> this morning. Very good. Rocío, are you there? Rocío? No, Rocío, Rocío tuvo que irse, se me dijo que le dijera. Ah, Eli, entonces, 13. Sí, me dijo que tenía que salir. Ah, ok. 13 is... Uh, my, my eyes? My eyes are getting tired. Are getting tired. I, I have been... Reading all day. Very good. Let's see. Um, Daniel Del Cid, 14. Okay. Uh, Bill hopes to find a new job. To soon. find a new job. He uh -huh. has been looking to find a new job soon. He has been looking in the paper and on the internet every day for the past month. Very good. 15, Elmer. The other one, teacher. Fifteen. Uh -huh. Yes. Andrea is planning to call the doctor this afternoon. She has been seeking sick for several days. She has been feeling sick. She has, been feeling, she, she has been feeling sick for several days. Very good. For several days? Yeah. Okay, very good. Clary, number 16. Clary's eyes are all red. She what, guys? She has? She has been crying. She has been crying. Crying. Has been crying. Been crying. Good morning. Perfect. Yeah. Very good. All right, guys, we're going to stop right here. Remember that tomorrow we have no class. Tomorrow is <coughs> Friday. And then yeah, Monday, yeah, we, yeah. we will begin on section three, okay? The Monday. Okay. Yeah, Monday. Okay, guys, thank you very much for being in class. Have a great weekend. Work on the platform. Okay, thank you. I'll see you next Monday, okay? Thank you. Bye, guys. Yes. Bye, guys. Bye, bye. 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 B